got it, we 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 got it. We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Welcome to Love and Hip Hop Hollywood, Season 3, Episode 1, California Dreamin'. Now the cast, um, wow, it's changed so much since Season 1. Um, I'm not sure if Hazel E and Masika, or whatever her name is, with her new baby girl, I think, with um, Fetty Wap, is in this episode, but um, we're just going to get into this. So, um, first we see it opening. I thought it was actually their wedding, but actually it was their photo shoot. But we all know by now, we heard this on, actually a couple days ago, that Ray J and Princess are now married. After what he went through on that reality show, I think he had two, a shot of, or for, for the love of Ray J. Um, he had that reality show. I watched it, and, um, he... I guess he picked the girl, and he even had the girl with the tattoo, but this is a wholly, totally different reality show. If you haven't watched it, go check it out on YouTube while you're here, you know, after you get done watching my video, of course, and you can go check that out, and, um, yeah, go check that out, and it's a photo shoot, and, um, yeah, but then after that, um, the, the guy says, oh, uh, we just want to take some shots of Princess real quick. And she looks all pretty. And this, I guess, is for a magazine or something. And Ray J's mother says, um, I want to talk to you. And I want you to get a prenup. Because um, you never know what might happen and so on and so forth. And Ray J says, um, I don't really feel comfortable about doing this. I mean, me and Princess are finally in a good place and so on and so forth. He also feels like that this is not the right time to be doing it, and um, he wants, uh, and she wants it done um, like right after the engagement party. So next we see Monique, and of course, um, I didn't really watch the last episode of season two, so I'm going off of what had happened in the last in the last time we saw. So um, she had broken up with uh, Rich Dollars. Now that guy, I think of him as kind of a player. He went up with Erica Mena, this person, that person, this person, that person. I mean, you can make a whole tree of people that he went out with. But anyways, yeah. And I hear that she's dating a girl now, but they probably talk about that later on in the season. And, um, yeah. And she has a new man in her house. Yes, but it's no other than her baby daddy Fizz. Um, yeah. And, uh. Yeah, and then we see Nikki. I guess she's having a party for something of her. Um, and then we see Brandy. I can't really, really uh, can't remember that much about Brandy. So we're gonna move on to Nia. She says her and Soldier Boy are still together. They're um at home. Soldier Boy is at home with their daughter. I think it's daughter, right? Cause uh, I love you, Pop. I remember watching it back in season one. You know, I really liked it, but then they were coming out because there's too many spin-offs shows to love and hip-hop. I'm sorry. But you got Hollywood. You got New York. And you got Atlanta. It's hard to keep up. They're still together. And then uh, we see Nikki and Shonda at the club with her husband, Willie, and he's trying to get movie ready for a movie role. And I guess it's like the, I don't want to put it like this, but like the black version of Magic Mike or something like that. I mean, that's how I thought of it because he was like, trying dancing on the pole or something like that and uh and then there's the mommy and uh mermosas um and molly's or somebody didn't get no apologies and then there was a part that i missed because there's kind of like a fire going on out here yeah so hopefully all of that um dies down and doesn't reach my area and um and then we see nikki and fizz um, they're taking baby steps in their relationship and Nikki asks his fizz for a key to his house and you know so on and forth so forth and they're taking baby steps in their relationship and I understand you know sometimes you don't want to go all in but at the same time you do and you don't want to get your heart broken and yes and then we see Moniz and Nikki and Tiara and they all meet up and Moniz is looking like a librarian but they're And then we hear the words out of her mouth, another baby, 
the hell is Monique talking about that she wants another baby with Fizz? Like, really? And you already have a son with him. I mean, I get that she wants him to look alike, but come on. And then we see, I think, there are some parts that I missed. But, um, uh, and then I think she tells, um, Monique tells Nikki that they're living, that Fizz lives with her. And Nikki didn't know that. So then she goes, confronts him, and tells him, and Fizz tells him, well, since you're not woman enough for something, then maybe we shouldn't be exclusive. And then Nikki tells her that, tells him that, well, well, Moniz told me, well, uh, let me give you this little onesie right here. She wants to have another, she wants your sperm. Let me give you this, this onesie right here, and so on and so forth. And, um, yeah, and then there's, there's some other parts that I missed again, because I was doing stuff. Yeah, because I just finished watching it just a few minutes ago, because it's Tuesday right now. It's not Monday, it's Tuesday. Um, and yeah. So, and then we see Shonda, and she's talking to her husband, Willie, if that's his name. If not, I'm sorry, I messed up. You know, if you watched the episode already, it's all good. I get it, I understand. And she says, so have you been stepping out on me? You know, but men, if you need to have a good man in your life, you know, I don't care if it's love and hip hop, if it's reality, whatever. You need to have a good man. And a good woman too. This is for the men too. You need to have a good woman in your life, you know. So, um, I thank you guys for watching. I don't know if I'm going to re review it again. Uh, talk with me. Tell me what you thought of this review. Um, I haven't reviewed a show in a while. I was going to review uh, Hollywood Divas, but I didn't. I mean, it was only six episodes. Six? What the hell? This show is only six episodes. Six. Don't make any sense to me. So, um, I thank you guys for watching. Subscribe. <laughs> Anyways, subscribe. And thank you guys for watching.